Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. On today's episode, I'm down here at Page Brothers RV. We're here to check out their jo Jayco um, vans. We're looking at four different camper vans. These look so good. So we'll go in and check it out. I'll chuck up the price so you can see the different prices of the different vans. Also, we'll be checking out a few other vans as well. So anyway, let's get in there and check them out. Before we go check out the camper vans, let's have a look at these little teardrops. They're so cute. So they're pretty tiny and you literally just pop the top off. And you just got a bit of storage up the top. Your bed, which I am assume has storage underneath it. And then this little cupboards with your power charger. You can plug things in here. You got your fridge. And you've got little lights and a fan. So how cute is that? I don't know how much they are, but uh, they're very, they're different. They're different. So if you just want to, you know, just need somewhere to sleep, it's definitely the thing for you. So this is the first fan we're going to look at today. This one's actually sold, but we thought we'll check it out. We're at Jayco today, and uh, obviously that's the toilet there. Adam, do you want to go in? Oh, and it's got a bench similar to ours that can lift up a three -seater. and extend your bench, which is good. This is a three-seater. Three-seater? Mm. Oh yes, yeah, so it's not like ours where you can walk through got the third seat that comes up which would be good for Twyla <laughs> she would like it oh wow look at that the rest in the middle and um, nice clean cab has a little bit of storage up here tiny bit of storage there hi guys and um, then you got the back which obviously is similar to ours it folds out but they got the microwave there the fridge there um, this looks like the shower let's have a look Oh yeah, nice, nice sink there, your toilet, which obviously swivels around while it's swiveled around at the moment, and you can go back around, and then we've got the cupboard space, power in there, and all your control centres up here, your antenna, TV hooks onto there. Yes, yeah, so this is pretty similar layer to ours, similar. And um, oh, they've got the small window back here. They haven't got a big window. And um, Adam's just looking at the sink. It's massive. It's a massive sink. Yeah, it's really deep. Let's have a look down here and see what this storage is like underneath the fridge. Okay, there's all the plumbing. And the hot water system probably. And uh, nice cupboards. Hmm, interesting. Bit of storage in there. What was that, Adam? The window should be larger. Yeah. And um, so this is the one we're looking at, looks like. RM91 Page Bros RV. Mm, okay. I don't know if that means anything. Oh, that's one good idea. What's that? The clips on there. Oh, there's clips. Oh, yeah. All right, now we're going to go into this Fiat. Check this out. And um, this one's a little bit different. So it's got the same thing here with the pull-up bench. It's got an electric um, step up. And then you've got your seats that spin around. Your table's here and you can have two extra passengers with seat belts. And I'd say that this would probably pull out to like a extra bed if you wanted to. Up here they've got some good storage, which is good. Um, they've got a little sunroof here, probably a fan in it. Um, you got your storage, which is great. This section not bad. Um, and then 
Over here we've got big bench space. This is a pretty, this is a lot, bit longer, this van. Um, you've got all your cupboard space, obviously your sink. The bathroom, I don't know if this is any bigger. Oh yes, it looks a bit swankier with the wooden floor in there. That's pretty cool. And then this one's actually got a bed. How cool is that? And then you've got your TV up in the far corner. Your microwaves here. And very big cupboards above where you sleep. Really big cupboards. So Adam, do you like this one? Do you like I don't it? Mind it? Yeah. Just the bed. And what were you saying about the cupboards? Well these are drawers. Oh you like the drawers. So they're easier to use. Yeah. Open the bigger one. How's it look? Oh yeah. Yeah, no, they're good. They're nice deep drawers. And I've just noticed they've got like a fake park tree flooring, which is kind of cool. And um, yeah, no, this is really nice. Nice colours. Down there. And the fridge, I don't know if I pointed out the fridge before, but the fridge is down here. And then um, obviously we'll go around the back and we'll check out the storage under the bed. So now I've come back around the back of the bed, Adam's still in there, and this is the storage you're looking at underneath the bed, which is quite a bit. And then they've even got a holder for your stick that goes there, so you can pull out your awning, a little light, which is quite good. And then in here is looks like all your pumps and batteries and everything is stored away in there protect that and um yeah so this is this van the fiat looks quite good oh adam's just spotted something look at this what's that adam is that like a another board that pulls out just a ben ex bench extension bench extension oh so got one on both sides yeah but well, any yeah, any bench it. space is good i reckon take it out to here <laughs> all this depth to work with. yeah and oh, we've got some light switches over here and that was where the TV was I've shown you before. Hmm. Do you like it, bud, Adam? I prefer the first one. You like the first one so far? Okay. All right, well, let's go check out the next one. It looks like they've got two Mercedes here. So let's check out the first one. I'll take you in there. Adam's already starting to explore. So it looks like this one's got cupboards that come through both sides, like that other one we looked at in the last video we did about vans. It's got the electric step as well. Step up, and it's very similar to the other one, but it's only got the one seat here on a little table. And then your front seat in your front turns around. Now this one doesn't have the storage that you'd normally get up the top. Um, but the inside looks absolutely beautiful. Look at that. That looks really nice. And then we'll spin around. I've got a, the windows with all the blinds all built in. Um, your sink, obviously. And then you've got all this power on there. I would probably wouldn't have gone for those lights. I mean, those power switches look a bit out of place right there. Um, they've done this so you can use this bench space as well. But then inside you've got your sink. And here you have obviously your um, stove top. Pull out drawers, which like we said, we're always good. And then got a fridge down there, microwave. Now these are different. I've seen these before in some vans where they just roll down. The only thing we thought is this, things might get caught up behind this sometimes when you're moving. So I don't know if I like the idea of those type. They look good. I don't know about them. It's got two built-in fans because obviously this table here and these will convert into your um, bed. So these cushions come down to the middle, the table will spin and go down and you'll have an extension to go there and you'll have your bed. So yes, and then we've got a TV here that you can put on your switches so when you're in bed you can grab your switches and then Adam has now <laughs> gone in he's behind here inside the bathroom how's the bathroom look Adam yes yeah, not bad look at it 
small mirror as well. Small mirror? Oh, oh, that no, I know. Let me let me check that out. All right, so you've got toilet like last time. It's a bit roomier, I reckon. And you've even got, hi guys, <laughs> a mirror. Oh, and look, check out the shower head. How gorgeous is that? Bit of style. So yeah, no, this one's a little bit bigger. Um, the door's not the biggest, but the actual shower seems bigger area. And even better, they've got a nice big vent in there, which is always good because it does get quite hot in ours. So we don't have one of these. We only have a very small vent. And you got a light in there, obviously. All right, well, what do you think of this one, Adam? It's a bit different. I still prefer the first one. You still prefer the first one, which is more similar to ours. Yeah. So I think that it just probably... just feels really cramped, right? Yeah, there. I think it does. Look, when you have these... It's just like... You know, yeah. Like, it's just really... It's better when it's all open. If this this had been up there and you didn't have that extra chair, um, you'd be creating all this space inside and it would make a big difference, I think. But, um, yeah. So this is the first Mercedes. I'll take you around the back and we'll have a look at the back and the storage and then we'll go check out the next Mercedes. Well, I'm just gonna show the guys in the back of this one, the storage. Now the storage doesn't look as big as the last one we went to because in the other one, they had the full bed set up all the time. In the one we looked at before, this one, you can have it not set up and you can use it as a couch. So that means your storage is limited here. And again, they've got all the bits and pieces in here. They've got your pole that goes in here. These is always good storage. This adds a bit of extra space for those bits and pieces. Your bug spray, your, you can put your um, uh, sun cream in there. But yeah, otherwise, that is the back of the first Mercedes. All right, this is the one we're going to look at next. So I'll go around the front and then we'll come back to the back afterwards. All right, so this is the next Mercedes. Um, yep, that's the front of it. Now this, I'm loving the color. I'm thinking this could be the next color we choose. It's like a gunmetal gray, and it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, see the good exhaust fan on top of there? How good's that look? Um, again, it's got the electric step. Um, you've got a spot here you can pop your shoes in, and then as well, these cupboards reach through to the other side. So if you're outside, you can grab what you need. You got your power lights here, so you can turn the lights on before entering inside. Um, got fire extinguisher. Again, they got the one seat. They got your adapter so you can be charging your um, computer if you're working in your van. Um, up here, you got your control center, then more storage. And then you come up, these seats, I think obviously spin around. So they'll spin around so you can have two seats here. You got the absolute the dashboard this nice view on this one look how gorgeous and clean that is that's really nice mercedes woof again they haven't taken advantage of this spot so you could put a shelf across here i think that would be awesome and then around here very similar kitchen i won't go through that again it's the same they've utilized the bench space by putting this over top of there and then on top of that we've got the shower which looks really nice and clean again, same as the other with the nice shower fossa thingy there. <laughs> and um, Adam's just checking out, what are you thinking, Adam? What? <laughs> What's that face? Negative Nancy. Okay, storage. It's really thin. Oh, it's very thin. Okay. Yeah, not as thick as what we have, but I mean, the lighter the better, I suppose. And they do have the support beams to hold the weight um, and again you can have this one won't have as much storage in the back um, because you've got the option to have your couch set up um, same cupboards as the last um, you've got your two fans at the back fans are fantastic we love ours we just got some charger ones that we can move anywhere in the van now we can even take them outside our van we like um, but these ones look like they're fastened in for good uh, we've got our TV stand here and yeah, so again, beautiful colour scheme. Oh, now something different about this one. They've actually got this fake tile, so it looks real. See now, that plug doesn't look as out of place as what it did in the other one. It looks quite good um, against the white. It looks fine. So Adam's just opening up the storage. 
but I think you get the idea of this one and uh, we might head to the back and check it out okay now I'm gonna take you around to the back of the van let's check this out so very similar to the last one S small amount of storage in the back um, but you do have all your uh, pumps and all the rest of it in here and yeah pretty much exactly the same so I won't go into it long but that's how the back of it looks so that's the four they're going to show and pretty much every single one of these are sold so if you're looking for a van you just probably all wait we haven't actually spoken to anyone yet so um but yeah definitely a wait if you're getting one of these vans um but yeah they're all sold 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 Now, if you remember on last week's episode, um, we actually got to see a really small version of this. This looks really modern. It looks so cool, an Airstream. And um, look at it, it's amazing. I don't know if we're allowed to win here, but Adam's just opened up the door. But this looks incredible. I love it. Let's go in and have a look. And hope we don't get in trouble. <laughs> Oh, I don't think you meant to be in here, Adam. Yeah, I thought it was unlocked. <laughs> anyway, let's have a quick look around before we get kicked out. But how cool is this? These leather seats. Um, you've got your oven, your stove top, that. Let's have a look at the bathroom. Oh, look, there's a shower. A oh, I love those windows. And you've got your toilet. You hope they're tinted. Oh, there's a blind there. So and you've really got a sink. Sorry guys, I'm filming this really quick because I don't think we're meant to be in here. But <laughs> how cool is it? Absolutely cool. You your bed set up there. Nice big windows. And you've still got the metal inside as well. So you can oh, see it. Get, I they get hot. Yeah, I wonder if it does get hot. Anyway, that's it. One, one big stainless steel pot. One big stainless steel pot. Let me take you around the back as well. Look at the dirt court curve on this door but too. How cool does that look? And then this is a bag. It was Michelle last week that we, we spoke to. Yeah, well, Michelle, I think yours definitely got a nicer ass on it. <laughs> you were saying how you loved the back of yours, and I think we definitely agree. Yours has got a nicer ass. But at the same time, this is very cute. Very cute and very different. All right, we thought we'll take you through this RV for something different, just to end this video. Um, <laughs> now, this has got push out sides on the other side, so I haven't even been in it yet. So let's go in and check this place out. It's huge. <laughs> All right, so we're coming up. There's a driver's seat. And above that, you've got a full bed. There's your ladder, your TV for the living room. Up here, you've got your command center. And check this fridge out. It is big. <laughs> Not like ours. Let me trade it open. Oh, there you go. Look at that space. Now, are we ready to look in the living room? Check this out. Woo! This is space. So you, this looks like the part over here that pushes out when you've when you're actually parked. Yes. So you got the two. Tracks. Yeah, you got the tracks. So it's on there. So it pushed out. So that would come in here when you're driving. But you got cupboard space up the top got leather seating you got more storage in here you got both got like wardrobes looks like either side of your bed the beds always made up look how nice that looks and then here you got your big tv to lay back and watch in bed you got a fan each his and his fans and <laughs> underneath you got heaps of storage look at this storage ridiculous don't tell me this is a dishwasher oh my okay they got a dishwasher <laughs> and they got a microwave down there or is that like a convention oven i reckon probably um you got your stove top sink more storage now let's head towards the back and check out the bathroom we know we love a good bathroom now here we have the shower big shower with big fan um, and then we'll go around here and have a look. Oh, it's got the same shower head as the 
in the camper vans. And then we've got our sink, nice. Oh, there I am, hi guys, again. And yeah, check that out, toilet. Now I'm just wondering, what is this dirty laundry or let's have a look. Oh, no, it's a washing machine. Yeah, definitely a washing machine. They've even got a soap holder. All right, well, there you go. And then they've got this roller door that closes. And uh, yeah, this is the looking back into the van. What do you reckon, Adam? Yeah. It's taken it to a whole nother level, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I hope you like this, guys. If you see anything else interesting before we leave, we'll film it as well. But um, we thought we'd just like to check this place out and see how the RVs live. I'm just sitting and enjoying the van, pretending that I'm living here. Oh, I feel a bit tired in here, bud. But um, yeah, imagine imagine us sitting in here, Adam. Our Twyla would be like a queen. She'd be like, oh, I'm just gonna hop up on the bed, run around. She could do laps around here. <laughs> Look, Adam's now getting comfortable. Yeah, that does feel nice. It, it is nice, isn't it? But no, we're sticking to our van. We're, we're van lifers through and through. None of this luxury for us, just way too big. And um, I think you'd just take more crap with you, to be honest, if you had all this space. But it'd be nice to do this around Australia or something like that. That'd be awesome. But um, anyway, we should get out of this dream and move on. <laughs> If you're looking for a van, I tell you, this place is definitely a place to come. They've got so much on show from, from RVs to vans to, you know, we've had to travel a fair bit to get here, but worth the travel. And look what we just found tucked in this corner. Another one of these vintage vans. Now this one has a, a looks like it's got a sold stick on it, but I think someone's going to do it up. It's very old school, but um, how cool is that? Um, but yeah, so they've got indoors, outdoors, there's a bit of everything. They've got pop-up vans, so indoors here, they've got a whole heap of these half vans, which pop up, um, which my dad's actually got one of these. Um, but yeah, so anyway, we'll keep looking around. Take it for a spin. Take it for a spin. That's nice. <laughs> Look, that's a, an original teardrop. <laughs> Love it. Well, guys, we're back home now with Twyla, who is in every video. So I'm going to pop her down because she's feeling a little bit uncomfortable. But, guys, I want to know what your favorite van was from this week's video. Comment down below. Tell us why you liked it. I want to get back to everybody's comments. Um, there was so much there to pick from. And, yeah, just tell us why you liked them. But otherwise, next week, it's going to be exciting. We are crossing a border. Now, it could be New South Wales or South Australia. Take your guess. Comment down below as well. Otherwise, we will see you 5 o'clock next week on Sunday, and we'll discuss where we're at then. Anyway, guys, have a fantastic week. Thanks for watching again. And, oh, make sure you like and subscribe. And when the little circle comes up, touch that to subscribe. And if you haven't seen any of our other videos, a couple of videos will pop up, touch them, and keep watching. Otherwise, see you at 5 o'clock next Sunday. Ciao, guys.